Hello. Colorful Unity demo. Two time and towers. That's some very interesting music. Uh, two time towers is a tower defense game where your towers have friendly fire. Oh dear. Turning a classic strategy game into all into an out of control bullet hell adventure. Navigate high intensity battlefields as you build towers, dodge bullets, de defeat enemies, loot currency, and most importantly, try to survive. No reviews. Coming soon. Um, the developer and publisher is Tinker Tinker Games. Cool. So you have graphics, quality is low. That's not good. High, full screen, cool. Controls, cursor size, large. That's better. Rumble. We don't need rumble. User data. Okay. Interesting. So, this is Unity, uh, and it is playable according to SteamDB on Windows, Mac, and Linux. So, perhaps a handheld? Alright, play tutorial. Alright, welcome to story mode. Here's where story stuff happens, but for the purposes of this demo, I'm going to use to teach you how to play. Now, yeah, see that the little guy in the middle of the field? Cute, right? That guy there? The Dorbs. Damn, he's ugly. A Dorbs. You're too kind. Little guy is me. Anyways, you can move me around in the field to do all sorts of things like build towers, dodge bullets, and collect currency. Don't worry, I won't get tired. My glutes are impeccable. Excellent. Now, let's talk towers see the menu in the right use it to select use it to select the tower click to place it on the field during enemy waves the towers will start shooting but here's the hard part i can get hit by our own bullets Ooh, that sounds like fun easy for you to say you're not the one wearing the overalls just be sure to dodge the bullets as they take down the enemies okay speaking of enemies don't worry most of them can't hurt me so feel free to push them around speaking of which don't let enemies reach the end of the level otherwise lightning will zap me and i'll be like ouch like his face. And that's about it for now. I hit the start button in the top left hand corner when you're ready for the first wave. Good luck. Alright, so I'm guessing they're coming out from here where the arrows are. The end space is where the end flag is, and we can move this guy around. So yes, we can. W A S and D. Alright, so there is collision for the trees. Okay. Alright, so quad shot. So Ah, they go on the tree section. All right, let's put it. Oh, okay. So you've got to move the you've got to move the guy. So you can build in the proximity of where you're standing. Okay. Can he do anything with them? Right click to upgrade. And then on this on the right hand side, we got some stuff that we can do. We can destroy. We can upgrade. Power up. All that kind of stuff. Cool. All right start so can we pop these guys on the head oh we just push them back okay so what we can block their path oh we can get hit by our own guys that's right nice well look at this the first wave life-changing experience sure you got a great taste in games you must be a publisher or some guy to pro gamer no Anyways, you may have noticed that when the enemies kick the bucket, a bunch of nuts and bolts burst out of them. That's right. That's currency. Be sure to pick it up. Purchase more towers. Be, be careful. Going for a juicy pile of currency may be the very thing that puts me in harm's way. Anything but gold hard cash. You, <laughs> you live a hustler, you die hustler. That's it. Just don't look up the magazine. Now, see that stazzy red bar at the top left corner? That's my HP. Enemies drop hearts. Be sure to pick those up to replenish my health. So you know, please don't let me die. And with those encouraging words said, it's time for some real action. Try to make the final wave for each level. So I had a look at the Steam discussions. Um, there wasn't many because there's not many not many people playing this. Um, how do we go back? All right, click to cancel. Okay. All right, we can't afford anything yet. That's fine. Um, yeah. So I had a look at the discussions and. Apparently there's a massive bug with a little turtle that will spawn soon. He just gets stuck and soft locks the entire game. Well we can we can pop him. I think. Oh no, we can push him into the tower. Yes. Oh, 
Oh, and the currency doesn't last forever. That's annoying. Alright, we picked up a bomb. Got him. Did we get hurt from that? We didn't. Might have just been right on the... Right on the edge. Okay, you made it to wave 2. Next level. Okay, ready for this. It's time to talk about tower upgrades. Thank God, yes, finally. Uh, more pew pew for you here. Right click in the place tower. Yeah, I saw this already. Upgrade towers, uh, stats, damage, number of bullets, status effects, and more. We can upgrade to a completely new tower with a whole new awesome ability. But remember, upgrading also costs currency, so spend wisely. Try upgrading different towers to see what kinds of options are available to you. Yada, yada, yada. Very good. Balancing. Give upgrades. Give upgrade. Give upgrading a shot during this level. Let's do this. That was my phone too, by the way. F to read. Upgrade tiles by right clicking. Okay. All right. So you want me to put scorcher on that one? This one. And there's only scatter. Can we do it again? We can. We don't have anything for it. That's okay. All right. So I guess we'll see what happens. And we've also got to be careful. We can't be too close to the towers either. Nice. Can't upgrade yet. It's fine. This is pretty cool. Not bad. Alright, looks like this guy was designed to be annoying. Okay, cool. So I got hit a couple of times there. That's fine. So it'll be just trying to work out what's going to be best. Okay. Can't upgrade that one. Can't upgrade that one. I can't do anything. Huh. Okay. They're gonna be okay. It looks like it. So we can we can kind of push them back. They do hit me. Is it them hitting me or is it? Yeah, I think it is. It's hard to tell. You also can't tell what kind of health points they have. Hmm. Very tricky. Alright, next level. Oh. Okay. Alright. Um. Okay, so just yeah. So they're gonna come down. So we may as well funnel them in funnel them into the middle, yeah. That's right. We can upgrade one of them. Bullet damage. Rate of fire. Probably with the vest. And that's it. Alright, we'll see how we go. Oh yeah. So positioning becomes a little bit more prevalent. Oh nice, I just picked up a bomb. Yeah, I've already done that. Bombs are special. Not only do they do massive damage, but they also clear away incoming bullets. E button to drop a bomb. Uh, getting out of the way. Um, what are the other items? Power-ups? Keep an eye out for blue capsules. Okay. So I've got five bombs. There's a snowman. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, we're in an octo shot. Shoots in eight directions. Um, here? No, I feel like it's a paste. Here should be good. And a bit closer to this one. Stack them. Can we upgrade it? No. Can we upgrade this one? Nope. 
Alright. So here we go. We've still got five bombs. Slimes. Alright, so not only do you have to be careful, you have to be careful of everything, don't you? It's like... You don't want to get hit by your own stuff. Ooh, there we are. So what did that do? Lock on. What's this? Locks on to whatever's nearest. Do we use that in conjunction with something? Alright, we'll find out. Um, that needs different materials to upgrade. I can't upgrade that one anymore. So this one, we'll do another speed up. Rate of fire on that. Okay, we still got five bombs. Let's go. Alright. He's, he's locked onto me. So, oh, he, it locks onto me. Oh. That's interesting. I picked something up that just targeted everything. Yeah. Huh. Alright buddy, time for something a little more advanced. The freaking wrench swing, baby. You ever wanted to whack a bullet right in that stupid bullety face? Well, now you can. Just left click the mouse to deflect oncoming bullets. Or hold down the button to charge up the swing, turning deflect bullets into mega bullet. Ooh. You can also use the wrench to swing to activate the lever over there. Trust me, you'll need to. Now let's see if we can play a bit of offense and defense at the same time. Well, I'm guessing if I hit that, it'll trigger it. Oh, right, I'm going to hit start. Um, I have no currency. Can I pick that up? Toggle. Ah. Interesting. Okay. What's this say? Swing the wrench to deflect bullets. Alright. Ah. We could just leave it. We could just do the lazy thing and just leave it. But this is kind of a cool mechanic where you got to use the towers mechanics itself. Got him. Looped. So what happens if I hit this again? No, nothing. Okay. That's interesting. That's it. Ghost crate, that's what I need. Wait, who's who's that coming? I think. Those poor ghosts, you killed them again. I'm not sure that's how it works. Who cares? All you need to worry about is that I, I'm i deactivating your precious tower. Let's see if you're up for a real challenge, deflecting my bullets. This might be scarier than the ghosts. Okay. Bring it. Shoot. Oh, missed. Can we turn this back on again? No. Locked it. Got him. That's pretty cool. Alright, next level. What was level two? Maybe that's in the free play. Uh, Alright, it's time to introduce you to gizmos. Gizmos are interactable objects you can find on the map. These include buttons, switches, repeaters, logic gates, and more. Oh god. Some gizmos are only activated by standing on them, hitting them with a wrench, or when they get hit by a bullet. Think of it as similar to reddish, stonish thing from that one. Uh, <laughs> quarry craft. Yes, quarry craft. Um, you can even use gizmos to make your own crazy contraptions in our map maker. You should try that later. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Test out some of the gizmos by helping me solve the puzzle in this level. If you need a hint, there's a sign that we can read. Good luck. Okay. Wow. Is that changing? It's changing something over here too on the left. Yeah. 
Okay. What are these? Oh, I thought I had to pick those up. It's just junk. Hmm. So if I stand on that one, all the red lights are on in the middle. Do we have to turn all the red lights on? Maybe that's what it is. That turns the lights on there. Oh no, add it there. There we are. And then... There we are. Cool. I was looking at the red lights here and here. Interesting. Alright, it's time for the final level of tutorial. We've been through a whole lot together. You help me build towers, dodge balls, blow up enemies. Yep, good times. Definitely one of my favorite player. Yeah, you don't screenshot this. No, uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh, time for your final test. Be sure to use all the super awesome gameplay stuff I've told you to get to wave 20. We're going to need it. Alright. Such a great player to grab so fast. Do me a favor, get out there and kick some robot butt for my sake. I am the level mascot after all. Don't forget to check out the endless map and map maker game modes afterwards. Wishlist the game, otherwise I'll be out of a job. That said, good luck, have fun, and let's play. Okay, cool. Um, so they're going to come in this way and go around and go out. It doesn't look like there is like a... Um, do we just have to stay alive? that there Put that there we just stack the front can we upgrade anything we've got these things red springs they must be for something else all right let's see how we go oh that's right You try and play it like a traditional tower defense, but you've got to be careful of the projectiles as well. Let's get a nice little spot just here. Get all the loot up. Very nice. All right, we can do another quad shot. Can we go on down here? We can um, put one there. Upgrades, no upgrades yet. All right, cool. Next one. I have one bomb. I'm not too worried about them going past, only because I want to know what happens if they get past. Magnet. Oh, I like that. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice. It'd be nice if you could tell, like, how much health the enemies had, so a health bar above them. And it would be really cool if I could, like, get a, like, a timer on how long it takes or how long I've got left on a, um, on a power-up. So bullet damage... Fire rate. We go from rate of fire. Speed up. So we can have Scorcher as well. But we got plenty of room. Okay, so lock on. This one I want to have like right here. My theory is that they'll Go for the ones that are coming straight out. And then we have another one. Yeah. So I'm thinking if we have access to those. Um, so the switches and everything. We can actually turn them off so we can go in. 
if we need to. We have a blockade. So what would that mean that it forces them around the corner? So if I put that by like here, would that then force them around? It means that they take a little bit longer. Let's find out. Oh look, those bullets are big. Yeah, they do, they have to go around. I have a shield, I am perfectly fine, but all the loot, oh it's so good. Fantastic. Alright. Spinner. Spins and shoots in all directions. Interesting. Oh, okay. Alright. Um, I guess I'll put you right here. Can we upgrade it? Orbiter. Creates a spinning orbit of bullets. Bullet upgrade. Shoots faster and spins way... Uh, shoots and spins, but way faster. Nice. Morning Star, hella destructive and hella unpredictable. Ooh. That sounds fun. Alright, Octo Shot again. So, with the friendly fire, it makes the areas more dangerous. Put another lock on. Another Octo Shot. We're just gonna tank this place right up probably wrong, but there we go, and it looks like the blockade either doesn't last or it gets broken, and that's fine, because it looks like the material you use isn't like shared with anything else, so put that there. Wow, it is a bullet hell. And I can just spam the click button. Oh, it doesn't work very well. Yep, so I'm not going to lose the game by... I'm going to I'm going to get killed by my own weapons. All right, go again. Maybe a speed up too. You know, in some tower defense games, they have the speed up mechanic where you can hit the button to speed up. See, I'm helping. some upgrades. We got here. Rock shot. Shoots a giant boulder that doesn't stop easily. Reflect for massive combos. Armed with a powerful homing missile. Oh dear. Yep. Alright. This one. Bullet damage. Sure. This one. Bullet damage. This one. Bullet damage. This one. Bullet damage. We're making it rain. That one's upgraded. That one's upgraded. That one's upgraded. Bullet damage. And this one shoots faster, but the shoots and spins way faster. Morning Star. Let's get the Morning Star and see what that looks like. Okay, start.
Morning Star isn't doing anything. Or if it is, I'm not saying it. Oh. Yeah, the Morning Star doesn't seem to be doing anything. Unless it is, and I just can't tell. This is a safe spot where I am at the moment, and I, I, unbelievably. All right, cool. Seven. doesn't fade out. Oh god. Yeah, so you're really disincentivized to not do what I've done, which is like an amateur tower-based stra strategy where it's just completely load everything up. missing out on all those drops because it's just chaos insane absolutely insane all right i guess we'll just keep going until we die um i guess if you had a whole heap of lock-ons right, destroy so my theory is that if we just had everything lock on? The morning star doesn't seem to be doing anything. So we'll get that one out. Quad shot. Quad shot seems to be the best bet for controlling. Octo shot. Power them up. Alright, what else we got? So, was it the spinner? Heat seeker. Oh, that was the upgraded. Yeah. This one shoots a giant boulder that doesn't stop easily, reflect for massive damage. Alright, we'll give it a go. Um, what else? We can do another quad shot. Do a quad shot there. No power-ups for that one. Alright, we'll see how we go with that. Massively gimped myself, but I did that on purpose. So at least we got a little bit more room to breathe. Oh, they're fast. The homing missiles aren't doing anything? Ooh. Got a whole heap of damage there. Yeah, the missiles aren't doing anything, and the dude's not shooting the rock. That's interesting. Ah, it does hurt when they go through. Right, so it just it's going to straight up kill me. But we can mitigate it somewhat with health pickups. Hmm. So the rocket launchers aren't doing anything, and neither is the boulder thing. Um. I think it's a little bit bugged. Okay, I guess we'll not worry about those then. We'll just go back to octo-shotting everything. See, if I spread out too much, 
going to be chaos even further. But you know what? Let's embrace the chaos. Fuck it. We can live as many times as we want in the video games. Because this is not real life. They say, oh, you only live once. Not in a video game. You live as many times as you want. Alright. Let's do... See, I would have thought that you're not allowed to do just full-on blockades to block the path to funnel them, but I guess not. Alright. The hard part's going to be finding a place that's safe. Eventually there will be one stray bullet that gets me. Hey, look at all punches them up. Wow, what the hell's happening here? Is that supposed to happen? I don't know if that's supposed to happen or not. Hmm. Maybe it is. It's like a smoke screen. We can upgrade. Spike trap. Repair. Fixes the blockade. Huh. So you fix it. But once you fix it, you can't do anything with it? Huh. I don't like that. I was going to repair it and then turn it into something, but I guess not. Alright. So... Yeah, because I can't do chill scatter. I need red bolts. What are these ones got? Disc tower. Oh man, there's more. Napalm. Wow. These guys? It doesn't have another one. Orbiter. Let's see what that looks like. Alright. Wave 10. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh. They must be like a smoke screen type thing to, to so it hides what's going on. I wonder if that interacts with a lock-on uh, tower. doesn't hurt us. Oh, nice. Alright. Another one. We have no bombs left. So it sort of prevents you from seeing what's going on, but also prevents you seeing what loot there is and upgrades. So, interesting. The effect is a bit weird. Oh, it's tanking the graphics down. Holy crap. I think this is a bug. Oh, that's terrible. Oh. 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 Yeah, that's, bad. that's really bad. Alright, can we upgrade anything big? Chill scatter. What about these ones? No. Can't do the napalm. Can't do the disc. Alright. If we have any more of these smoke screen ones, we're gonna I'm gonna have to stop. Because it tanks the graphics right down to a snail's pace. Yeah, I think this effect is a bit buggy. Did 
So I know I should be going in there to shoot, but there's a smoke screen. Oh, it's starting to go down again. Straight in. Tank! So is he immu immune to? Oh, no, he's not immune. It was just part of the story to reflect bullets back. That's good. Oh, I'm getting hit. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. And I'm dead. I shouldn't have done that. Game over. Oh, really? You're not going to put me back? Try again? Shit. I did not do that. I genuinely did not do that on purpose. Still going, though. I wonder if I leave it. What'll happen? <laughs> My body over here behind the tower is just getting smacked. Insult to injury. So that green tower, wave ended. Yeah, no, that's it. Oh, yeah, that's actually pretty cool. Enjoy game, don't forget to do a wish list and join our Discord. Yeah, no, I'm not going to join your Discord. A oh, wish list though, that's pretty good. I like it. It's not bad. Um, if you got the map maker, yeah, the map maker is probably going to be insane. Create a new map. Uh, biome. Factory. I don't know, forest, reset, just grass, wave type is endless, map size, custom, large, oh, the buttons are cut off, community, downloads 4, 6, 4, 8, 10, 4, 5, TTT, I'm guessing that's Tinker Tinker They maps Three waves, six waves, one wave That's pretty cool Test I see your test Alright, let's have a look at it real quick So, create new map Yep, new map, forest, just grass, endless, large Go Okay So Dirt Yep, water Poison. Mud. Cool. Alright. Decoration. Bush. Rocks. Arrow. How do you turn it around? Pipe. Huh. Ah, you click and drag. Flowers. Fence. Oh, crates. Oh, can go. Shop. A shop. Power tower. Signpost. Into text. Shop. I can't interact with the shop. I can't do anything with that. Oh, here we go. Right click changes the. Cool. Size. Oh. Player spawn. Gizmos. Yeah. Triggers, teleporters, LED panels. Oh god. It's like it's like Factorio with circuits. That's too much for me. Enemy paths. Nice. Towers. Buddy. Hello friend. Heat seeker, rock shot. Yeah, I don't think the heat seeker and the rock shot work unless I had them placed incorrectly. Because they didn't do anything for me. What's this? Demon. Interesting. Tesla Tower. Corrupt Circuit. Cool. Well, there you go. It's a demo and it's got like a map maker and everything in it already. So yeah, I, I highly recommend you go check it out. That's really cool. It's a it's a cool take. But yeah, that's tiny. Tiny towers? No, it's two timing towers. Tiny towers, where did that come from? Not sure. 
Two Time in Towers, yeah, I'd check it out um, if I were you, if you like that kind of thing. I reckon this would be really, really cool. Developer, get some more support for controller because Steam reckons it's partial control. This would be really cool as a handheld, as just a, a mess around um, while you're, you know, either public transport or you're hanging around doing nothing. I reckon it'd be really, really cool. But yeah, that's it for me. Thanks very much. See ya.